So lung carcinoids um, are certainly different from other neuroendocrine tumors, but they share many of the, of the same features, such as imaging and treatment. The next generation of nuclear imaging and nuclear therapy are the gallium-68 doted tape PET-CT and the PRRT. So let me explain a little bit. So the gallium-68 scan, which has been very much the buzz in the news recently, is the next generation of Octrea scan. It essentially images something called the somatostatin receptor on the neuroendocrine tumors. And many, many of the neuroendocrine tumors express somatostatin receptor. However, it's important to understand that some tumors do and some tumors don't. And in general, lung carcinoids tend to express the receptor at a lower rate. And so the gallium-68 may not always work for lung carcinoids. It seems to work a little bit better for other types of tumors. But it's still a very powerful test and can give you a lot of information. Now the PRRT is something called peptide receptor radiotherapy. And essentially, instead of putting a light bulb on the back of the octreotide molecule to take pictures, such as the gallium scan, you can actually put a bomb behind it. And so there are two isotopes that are being used right now, something called yttrium-90 and lutetium-177. It's a systemic therapy so that the, the molecule travels all around your body, goes to your tumors, and continually radiates them. For lung tumors that are strongly positive on gallium or octrea scan, it's a very, very effective and nice therapy. If your octrea scan or your gallium scan is negative, then it won't work as well because the tumors don't express the right receptors or the right, essentially the right targets. So it all depends, and again, that's why it's good to see a specialist to figure these things out. The PRRT therapy is, is being evaluated right now in a clinical trial, but it's only for small intestine neuroendocrine tumors. So it's still limited. But in Europe, Australia, and other places around the world, they're giving PRRT as a systemic therapy for neuroendocrine tumors. And the experience with bronchial carcinoid is that it's, it can be effective as well for people who have systemic disease.